The excitement is non-stop. <laughs> okay. You guys are not ready for this. I can tell you. Okay, one second. Let me get your oracle first. Okay. <laughs> Scorpios, the excitement is non-stop. Okay. Let's see first. I'm gonna tell you why. I'm gonna tell you why, of course. Oh. What is this? I I and ba school or fan. What? I try to project. Okay, there's something that you feel. Okay, you feel like it's not gonna work out. You feel left out. You feel that it's like something is missing. You're trying to figure out a way to make it work, make it happen. You've done everything possible, human possible, um, you know, in a sense. And I feel like it's time for you to pick up the pieces, Scorpio. You really have to get up, get going, and move. Okay. Because you have imagine and clean it up. Now, I understand. You're probably feeling a little funky today. You feel like, oh, Sal, I'm not, I'm not in the mood, Sal. Well, I'm here to put you in the mood because you better pick it up or I'm going to come hunting you and we're going to pick it up together, okay? No, you really feel sad, a little bit upset, a little bit left out, okay? So we're going to get you through this, okay? So we're still in November. I hear you, okay? But you know me. I prepare people here for the most wonderful, abundant one year that is coming, okay? And we're going to do your tarot. I have your astrology here, okay? Uh, yeah, I'll do this one first, okay, for the Scorpio. But hear me out here, Scorpio. I am just so thrilled because I have prepared us already, which we need to start it ahead, okay? This is the wealth corner Okay, my golly, Sal, what did you do? I know, this is the wealth pot. It's a golden wealth pot, I call it. These are all the essentials that I have from Vastu and Feng Shui together. Okay, my golly, Sal, it's like a ramen noodle. No, it's not ramen, okay? I'm just hungry. So everything that I have used for the past um, five years in Vastu, Okay, and then feng shui, it's all here. And it's all about wealth. Okay, so these are the essential. It comes with a guide. I'll talk more about it in a little while. I am just excited because I finally found a way to put it together. Uh, you know, it's like I'm very like, oh, I need everything this way, this, that way. So this is all a process. We got Goddess Lakshmi over there. Oh, dear Lord, I am amazed. Okay, we have some emperor coins going on. And later okay uh, i'm just excited uh, it's available now it's down there yes now you're gonna ask me so isn't it too early no you gotta do it before um the turn of the year so the process has to start once you start doing it it's like it's you know you're too late okay and uh it has a class on its own meaning you will you will receive a tutorial on how to prepare your home of course for the upcoming year i know i work in advance here guys mm. here we go let's see Oh, what's happening here? As much as I project wealth, prosperity, okay, Five of Pentacles is here. Mm -hmm. This could be something, I don't know why it's not focusing. Okay, all right, there we go. Uh -huh. So Five of Pentacles is the challenge, okay? No contact, no communication if it's relationship, okay? Um, you feel that it's like, that's not fair, you know? Um, ghosted could be um, this is the time where oh personal reading for 2025 is down there as well you can book an appointment with me on um, one-on-one -on -one FaceTime or WhatsApp and also um, how do you call this um, one question reading is down there available where I, I do my prediction for your relationship and I sent you out a video okay it's down there so five Pentacles um, hardship challenges of course uh, in a way where you just don't know you know, it's like, it's so uncertain. Um, it, they're there, but no contact. It's like, if there is, it's very minimal. Okay, so your relationship is very trending. It's minimalist. Okay, so even relationships, Sal, I'm, you know, I'm trending, minimalist, you know. Less, you know, less contact, less seeing each other. Because it's about being minimalist, Sal. <laughs> I feel like minimalist was a trend long time ago, guys. So. And we can't use it for Five of Pentacles. But that's what it's giving right now. And Three of Pentacles is here. Okay. Okay. So, okay, there we go. 
my monitor is not cooperative. Uh, um, three of Pentacles, five of Pentacles. Uh, they're busy. Okay, for others, you're start. This is three of Pentacles with the five of Pentacles. Um, you're working really, really hard to get you across certain financial issues. Five of Pentacles. Uh, but as far as the three of Pentacles is concerned, Scorpio. I'm seeing here that you're really, um, you're really trying just to forget about this. Out, I want to move forward, and your person, yes, they're busy. But here, both of you are suffering in cold, right? Even though you're trying to forget them in the cold, it's like yeah, it is what it is. You know, you could be in that mode right now, yes. But you're here for a reason. You have a two of swords, which only means Sal, like you have. You have a crossroads in your life right now. Jupiter retrograde in your seventh house. This is your person or you have an expectation. It's like, no, we haven't. This is not it. This is not over, you know. But it's not about reconciliation. It's really about, did I do the right thing? Okay. Mercury in the first house gives you, um, how do you call this? Um, uh, like, very smart, intellectual. You know, I like this because this is something about, let's just say, um you you know how to resolve this but it's just taking you time but as soon as you find out like sal i got it i know what to do you you know like you'll take action you got me mm -hmm. okay person right now wants to show pride queen of wands three of pentacles like all right well i'm busy i'm busy so i don't know and you know, this is their energy to survive very strong independent individual as well queen of wands um, amazing, good looking, Queen of Wands, of course. Um, this is someone who's empowered, ahead of their game with regards to their career, Three of Pentacles and a Queen of Wands. So they show, they, they can deliver. Your person who you haven't been in touch with, they do deliver on their career, on their coins. Okay? And you feel actually ignored because they are focusing on that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But you could have blocked them as well. Hi, Priestess. Uh, you're saying here now that it's like, hmm, okay. Um, if you're going to do this, I will double down on this. No contact, no communication, fine. Block, delete, you know. So what you're doing here is like an upsize, you know, when you go to those fast food chain. Would you like an extra of this? So for you, you're doing extra work here just to really forget about them. Okay, delete, block clear everything you know burn their clothes and all those things no no no, it's not like the high priestess but yes so for you it's like no this is a no no contact no communication double down on this one i'll move to a different state country if i have to just so that we don't see each other ever again if there's a ticket to mars i will fly to mars that's how tough you are Ooh, child okay <laughs> relax okay relax Eight of Pentacles, um, you think a lot of your person, <laughs> your person is so busy, I have to be honest here, trying to like really focus on their work that they haven't really ponder or thought about what you guys have. Okay? Um, intentional could be, yes, Eight of Pentacles and Three of Pentacles, like I'm just going to soak on my work so that way I don't have to think about the Scorpio anyway. Like that, you know what I mean? So they're doing this. Oh, what do you call it? They, they want to be occupied, preoccupied, right? So that way, the conflict of the no contact, they don't even see the day or the time anymore. So it becomes easier for them. This is, oh, coping. There you go. So this is how their coping mechanism is as far as no contact. Okay. Let me see. As uh, I am the guidance, the guidance comes over here. Okay. Let's see. Scorpio, what do you bring to the table today? Confusions out. Seven of Cups. Why you do this? Hmm. You want to text them. Oh, they are definitely in their impact. They're empowered. Okay. So you want to text them with the Page of Cups. You want to have the Seven of Cups over here. You feel lost right now because um, you, you kind of like, I don't really know where it is right now, Sal. It's just like no contact, no communication. But then what do I do? Right? Page of Cups and Seven of Cups is like, it's confusing because I still have feelings, you know, still there, lingering. And then I feel like they don't care. Like, do they care? You know, you, know, you don't need validation, but you just be like, like are they done? You, you understand me? So there, this energy is not participating right now. Okay. 
Now, for the Scorpios who's here, who's watching, Five Pentacles, High Priestess, and Seven of Cups, you have ideas on top of ideas for career, growth, buying this, you know. Um, you know, Seven of Cups, a lot of dreams happening. Five Cups is overwhelming or you want it. Two Cups, of course, toxic, meaning sometimes it's the love part. Um, but with the Page of Cups, you want to pursue the love part. But if you are manifesting High Priestess and the Five Pentacles, right, you want... Um, you want to get yourself out of a bind. Let's just say that. Okay, five pentacles. Um, this is what I've created. Okay. I, I hope I can lift it. It's heavy, guys. Okay. So here, uh, these are the essentials. I, I hope it can focus. I hope it doesn't fall. Okay. The essentials for this uh, 2025. Everything that you can find in my house, except me, okay, is in this. Your Golden Wealth Bowl. Energize for 2025. This is available now, okay, for... It's pre-order, but I have to make... There are certain things here that I make myself, of course. Here, there are greens that I would put in it. Now, we're talking about magic here. Okay, I'm not going to shy away from saying so this one you need to put in your house. Okay, these are all in the money corner, which I will explain how to find the money corner in the house, where is it located, and then where this money pot gonna go, the wealth pot, okay? Now, there are things here that you will only get, of course, from me, because this one, you, I don't know if you're familiar with this one, but this one has money inside it, okay, that I will give to you guys. Okay, so this basically is a... Um, Magnet for more money and luck. You put this in your wallet. Alright, this one. I'm not going to take it out. Now, Goddess Lakshmi, you guys know how much of a devotee I am for Goddess Lakshmi. Okay. I have lotus. I have everything. Jasmine. I have everything for Goddess Lakshmi. That has brought me even more wealth. We're talking about serious six figure. And I don't shy away from talking about, oh, he's a businessman. I'm an entrepreneur, this and that. Call me whatever you want. I like what I do. Whatever. Okay. I'm happy. You not. Okay. So, <laughs> all right. So, it's available now. Complete, of course, with a guide and a video. I will send out how to use it as well. The earlier, the better because we need to channel the energy. As soon as it's, um, you know, in the coming days, you know, the holidays, you won't have time to do the cleanse, to do the money corner. And then next thing you know, it's the turn of the year and then you miss out again on the opportunity. Okay. So it's available, it's down there. I believe, yes, it is free shipping in the US. Yes. And we do ship to more than 90 countries across the globe. Yes. So it's down there. Okay. Now, it will be, uh, I'm not sure if it's pre order because it happens on some of it, but you, you got to put your order ahead of time. You understand me? Okay. Because I will be gone. Okay. In the coming days, of course. So I, that's why I would just want to get it, um, you know, I'm going to get it ahead. Got it, Scorpio? We good. Okay. Now, in your end here, you got seven of cups and a page of cups. Oh, sorry. Okay. I need to make sure it's stable. <laughs> okay. So, your person, uh, I'm just going to be honest here. They're living rent free inside your head. You've been thinking about them day and night. Okay. And they know that you do, and they enjoy this. Because the Empress is here and the Queen of Wands, if it's masculine or feminine, whatever you want to call it, but this is being a diva. Okay? So diva is a female version of a hustler. So then if it's a masculine, it's a hustler. They know you do think about them. They know 100%. So this is not the first time that you guys have no contact. Uh, Queen of Cups over here. Your person basically says like, I'm just going to pull the strings here and a Scorpio will come wanting me. I haven't done your astrology. Okay. I will. Don't worry. Ooh, Sal, then fine. Let it be. Ten of swords. Yeah, see, this is what you don't do with a Scorpio. It's a central now. The central card right here. You do not push them. You do not. They are like robots who will do self-destruct. If this is going down, I'm going to bring it down with me and we are done. Oh, they do that. Okay. They, they do that. Okay. <laughs> My accent is thick. I have, you know, I'm cultured like cheese. No, no. <laughs> um, ten of Swords is really like, if they don't, meaning this person keeps doing this, uh, I'm done. I don't care. I don't care. 
So this is a self-destruct mode with a Scorpio, which in your chart, let me see here, Scorpio, okay? In your chart right here, Mercury will go retrograde pretty soon, okay? Um, I am making something special for Mercury retrograde as well. Um, if it's available, you will see it down there. I don't know if they made it already, but I already made it, but I don't know if they post it there already, okay? But that one is for reconciliation. It's mainly focused to bring in, okay, a connection that we have had our chance, but we feel the missed opportunity. Because Mercury retrograde in the first house for you, you want communication, no contact. So it's going to be down there. It's, it's for Mercury, focusing on Mercury retrograde. That's only for like 30 days that I'm, I, you know, that is available during the time, you know. So that's how I use the transit, okay? Okay, so that's down there as well. Now, Venus is in the second house for you. It's supposed to be a time for money. Yes. Okay. Blessings on top of blessings. That's, that's good. Because now your 12th house, Lord, what your losses becomes your earning. Yeah, amazing. Amazing for Venus ruler of the 7 and the 12. If you have business, okay, this is a time where what you make can come towards your what you keep. Someone, some people love makes a lot. But they never keep this is now going into your same amazing again okay now one thing that is confusing you big time okay is this uh, rahu in the fifth which means that your relationship has been let's just say six flags why there is a roller coaster and there's a lot of red flags i'm just saying i'm just saying okay i don't see their ill intention yet i don't see that not at all mm -mm. So breakup and separation is here. Let me see. Oh, Scorpio, why do you do this to me? You have the full card. There's 50-50. Meaning, the two of you can come back. You win. Or they win. Meaning back together. Or it can also be like, this is it. You take a, ch a chance, a leap of faith with the fool. And I'm done. And they're done. And that's it. We move on. We all move on, finally. From 2024 to 2025. But we haven't reached that conclusion. We shall see first now. Okay, Scorpio? So hold on tight. Ooh! This might be it, Scorpio. Now, it gets really intense, very serious, in the extended reading. I hope you understand that what we see there will change your life forever. I'll see you. Link in the comments in the description box below for the extended reading. I'll see you.